I played James, um, and he is basically um, a lieutenant in the uh, Vargas cartel. Uh, he's not in the first episode because that's set in Mexico, but then after that we move to Texas and uh, he's one of the local guys, he's like the, uh, the manager of, you will, day-to-day -day operations, and uh, he comes into contact with um, Elise's character, uh, Teresa. And uh, they kind of have this uh, love-hate, discovery, unsure of each other relationship. And that kind of pushes us through a lot of the narrative of the season. So, um, is your character one that appeared in the novel, or is it a new... No, completely new character. Um, my character wasn't in the novel and wasn't in the TV novella. So, uh, original, right here. Nice. So, <laughs> how, does it, you know, how does it feel to know you're like, creating something and having an original for this particular thing that there may be a lot of fans out there for? I think it's a really interesting opportunity actually because obviously a lot of these characters um, have a different incarnation, you know, uh, whether it's in someone's mind as the reader of a book or whether it is uh, a character on the TV novella. Uh, and so with that there comes benefits but also, um, you know, some challenges because some people may have ideas and I guess with my character no one has a, a predisposition so they will accept whatever I bring to the table yet it's within a world that they kind of may know of their fans so it's a really great opportunity and I hope uh, people like it. And what are, you know, you want people to like show obviously but what are you hoping like people are going to get out of watching the show like as they tune in like every week? I guess I want them to get a sense of not just the inherent like drama, the, the human relationships and stories, but also a sense that they're not quite sure what's going to happen. Because especially like with my character, you may think you know what he's about and why he does things, but the way it's been designed is a really a season or a multi-season arc. So you're not going to know what he's about in two, three episodes, you know? Um, and so I think for those people who really invest in the whole season, they're going to get the full experience as opposed to, you know, just dipping in and out because it's really a show which has that longer, slow burn narrative. Because he wasn't, you know, in the telenovela or the book, I didn't have the same amount of information to build the character. But what I did have was the shooting script that the writers give me and actually that is more normal. So it wasn't like I was lacking um, because even if there is an original source material, uh, that always is different from the actual um, screenplay that you're given. So the screenplay is really your Bible, the relationships you have with the, um, the showrunners, the writers and the director. And so you build the character. So I still had a lot to go on. And um, of course, as with any TV series, you're actually, as an actor, still learning. So all of a sudden, episode five, something happens, I'll be like, hang on a minute. This kind of doesn't make sense. All right, how can I readjust? So it's difficult. There's challenging, but there's also excitement. Um, and, you know, it's, it's a new way of working as opposed to working with, like, a stage play when everything is fixed. So it keeps you on your toes. Um, and uh, I'm excited myself to see how it turns out because I haven't seen a lot of the episodes either.